Ooh, oh, we're adding turn signals for legality back and to the I Yamaha MT-03. I'm going to start with by taking the former whale tail, and we're going to take each one of these bolts. There's a 3mm th hex that's going to be used for a lot of it like this. They're really tight. See how I had to break it free? Just move your way along there, and then use these push pin poppers. You pop those out like that. And then again towards the top edge, there's two more, so four holding it. The little wing comes out. Then there's more 3mm bolts. Now these are weird. They have a little aluminum spacer. Repeat that for the left and right, symmetrical all the way down. I'd say these bolts probably tighten to about 10 foot-pounds. You really got to snap them free. I think the shaft of the screws and bolts really seized into the receiver or the plastic housing. You hear it squeaking. That's a Phillips. He's a Phillips screwdriver to undo this, this part here. Then there's two more Phillips screws on either side like this. Those are securing the turn signal housing there, that liner housing. Undo that and then voila, look at that. It pops right out. Now you're going to need to pull these wires out. They're strung between there. There's the connector. Plug this black connector into the corresponding black connector under the seat. Just work your way the up The central there. connector that's kind of yellowish in color here must be for the license plate light. Rather. Make sure to plug this white connector here into the corresponding white connector under the seat and then fold over the cables and snug them down. Just keep popping these cables out here. Now there's a weird grommet system here. There's a plastic shim that interlocks with the rubber. You gotta slide that off and then push the rubber grommet through the hole. Just like that and you can free the turn signal. And then push the little plastic through the hole and drag the cable out. And there you go, you got a turn signal. Do the same thing on the other side. You gotta first undo that little bracket, that plastic bracket off, push the rubber out, and then Freeze the turn signal like that and pull the cable through like that. There's the two cables. Woohoo, it worked!